Ah, oh, what a beautiful day for science. Hmm, right, let's see. Sammy, where are you going? Uh, to take a shower, of course. And why are you wearing a scientist robe? Which robe? Huh, this robe? No, no, you're mistaken. It's a bathrobe. Yeah, huh. yes. Well, fine. Is she gone? Phew. <laughs> Let's see. <sighs> Pushing. Number one, two, four, three. Scientific notepad. Currently, the object of the experiment looks like an ordinary school notepad. By the way, I was always curious how many notepads does an ordinary student use over the school year? Write your answers in the comments! I'll study them! So let's get back to this notepad. I'll continue covering the notepad with special liquid. Wow! Uh, Susie! How, how did you get here? Well, I followed you and came here. <gasps> What's that? Wow, cool stuff! Oh, no, no, no! Put it down! Here, take this and follow the instructions closely. All right. Hmm, interesting. Uh, uh, oh! Ugh. Right, while Susie's busy, we'll continue. I have no idea how she manages to get inside a secret laboratory. I use a password and things like that. Your password is candies. Everyone knows that. Huh. I'm covering the notepad with special liquid. Oh! Oh, Sam, there's a heap of candies! What? Where? Where? Oh, I'm coming! <laughs> Sam will be really surprised. Looks like they're out of candies. I'll continue. There. I need to cover the surface really well to make sure the experiment is a success. Here. And here. And now, I'll leave it to dry. Put this one here, and that one there, and... Uh... What's going on here? Well, I've tidied up a bit. Surprise! Tidy up? Oh, now everything was in their place! I won't find anything now! On the contrary, Sam. I've placed everything neatly, and it's easy to find now. Uh... Here's your new <laughs> notepad. Oh! It's cool, huh? <laughs> awesome! You've just covered the notepad with thermochromic paint, that's all. Thermo what? Thermochromic. It changes <laughs> color when you touch it. Where did this paint come from? Well, maybe someone brought it in. I wonder if this someone is called Susie. Hmm, could be. And this someone has ruined the purity of the experiment! I had everything planned out! <laughs> now I'm never going to get the Great Slime Seed Science Award! Oh, of course you will! <laughs> You. Here, let's take this. And this, of course. And this one's from me. And we'll make a lava pen. A lava pen? Yep. Watch. We'll take out the rod, then glue the opening on the rod like this. Um, do you have a dropper or something in here? A dropper? Well, sure. I don't know. It's kind of suspicious. She's acting as if she 
found the laboratory. Uh, well, we'll see. So what's Susie doing in there? Oh, fine. Drop her. There you are. Great! Look, I've labeled everything to make it more scientific. Ah, well this, this I approve. Yay! Now I'll drip a little bit of everything in water. And now, let's add some colorful glitter. There. And insert the rod back. And voila! I've made a pen like this for myself as well. But I added different glitter. See? Look how pretty they are! is good enough for writing down the results of the experiment. By the way, I was going to do another experiment. Would you like to be my <gasps> assistant? Would I? Of course! Then bring me the box with the pens from that shelf. Uh, a uh, box with pens? Yes, yes. You do know what pens look like. Uh, yes, but I use those pens to create the lava pens. What? What? How could you? I was going to make the world's coolest pen robot! Oh. Now everything's rolling! I'm sorry, <laughs> Sammy. Uh, would you like to have my lava pen, too? <laughs> Guys, maybe you can help me, too. Give Sam a thumbs up to support him. 3,000 likes may cheer him up. Oh, Sam, wait! Psst. Guys, if you aren't allowed to use a hairbrush in class, I'll tell you how to hide it. You'll need a flat comb and a spiral notebook like this. Let's apply some glue onto the comb. There and glue it directly to the spiral. <laughs> Let's see if it's secure. Great! Now nobody will find our comb, but it'll always be at hand. So, I think I'm allergic to your antiseptic spray! <laughs> that's not spray, that's my new rose water. I don't get it. Guys. If you want to surprise your friends at school, try pouring your rose water or a scented spray into a different container. I've selected an antiseptic spray container because Sam doesn't like it. <laughs> now I need to remember where my rose water is. Many of you have probably lost flash drives at some point. To prevent that, we'll hide it in a lipstick. You've probably already guessed that first we need to take the lipstick out. But if you have some used up lipsticks at home, you better use those. Phew! The most difficult part is done! Let's see if our flash drive fits. <gasps> Perfect! Let's apply some glue onto the flash drive. This should be enough. And glue it inside the lipstick tube. Voila! Very handy! You'll never lose this flash drive. And the last trick. Some magic and toothpaste. Boom. If you have a bit of paint left, you can revive it with the help of toothpaste. Add some water to the paints. When they become softer, you can add toothpaste. Mix it well to get the shade you need. Now you can paint away! So oh, cool! And unusual! If you like my school life hacks, give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel!